Save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile and get fiber-powered internet at home and unbeatable 5G reliability on the go. So whether you're playing a game at home, yes, cool, or attending one live, no! you can do more without spending more. Learn how to save at cox.com slash internet. Cox Internet is connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Cox Mobile runs on the network with unbeatable 5G reliability as measured by Ookla LLC in the U.S. to H 2023. Results may vary, not an endorsement. Other restrictions apply. Start your summer road trip at Midas and get up to $30 off your next repair service. Plus, get a free closer look vehicle check to make sure you're road trip ready. So if you need a brake service and alignment check or tune-up, hit up Midas for up to $30 off. For more details, request your appointment at Midas.com. Tune in is the audio platform with something for everyone. News. In order to secure convictions in a court of law, it is essential that we conclusively. Sports. That clock at four. Donchich. The step back three. You bet. Music. You set my world on fire. Yes, oh. And even podcasts. Whatever you love, hear it right here on TuneIn. Go to TuneIn.com or download the TuneIn app to start listening. I'm going to talk to the newest Wichita State basketball commit. His name is Zane Meek. Zane, how are you? Good. How are you guys? We are doing well. So you obviously are a veteran uh, of college basketball. You, uh, this will be uh, your fourth stop at Wichita State. You are from Kansas. Does this almost feel kind of like a, a full circle moment for you? Yes, it very much feels so. I spent you know the first five years of my career out west of the Rockies, and now it's going to be very nice to come back home. How did how did everything? Uh, how did you end up here? Give us a little rundown on uh, on on how it went. Well, you know, I mean, college basketball itself is just crazy across the country. And as I was fighting through the portal, one of the things I really wanted was to be closer to home. I've never had an opportunity for you know, my friends and family to really come watch me play more than one game at a time. So I was very excited about the opportunity just to be closer to home. Friends, family, obviously love Wichita and its community and just very excited to be a part of it. Zane Meeks, our guest, he committed to uh, Wichita State uh, basketball uh, just recently, just a couple of days ago. So, uh, yeah, what else kind of went into that decision? When you're in the transfer portal, you talked about it being close to home. Are you also looking for a home? We all we know that, you, you know, the college basketball landscape has changed, which you're a part of, and we'll talk about that. But do you look for someone, a, a place that feels like home? Do you look for opportunity? Is it a combination of a number of things? What What do you look for? I mean, I think everybody has to look, you know, decide for their own what they're kind of looking for. I mean, for me, I was looking for fit and close to home. You know, I think Coach Mills and the staff are just incredible. They've had a lot of success. Um, they play my type of basketball. So those two, you know, those things really stick out to me. And, you know, like I said, Wichita is a great community. My, pa- my parents lived down there back in the day. Like my entire dad's side of the family is from western Kansas. So, yeah, I mean, it really is home. What the uh... – with with you, you play. Obviously, things didn't go well last year. What happened there? I know you got injured. Is everything all right right now? Yes, I'm all good now. Just you know, some unfortunate stuff when I got to campus there last year, but you know, fought through it, and uh, now I'm fully healthy, ready to go. Tell us what uh, kind of player Wichita State will be getting. Obviously, they were looking for a big man, but you uh, you can get out uh, on the perimeter too. Yeah, you know, I'm coming in looking to give our guards a, a lot of uh, room to drive down the lane, stretch the floor with some threes. You know, I, I consider myself to be pretty fundamental, um, rebound well, and, you know, just be a great teammate, loud communicator on defense, and, you know, bring experience to the court. So what did what were your experiences like at your other stops? You got to go uh, to some pretty cool places. I mean, Arizona State, we know its reputation. I don't know if you party too much there or not, but San Francisco is, is a beautiful town. Nevada is a great area. You, you said, like, all west of the Rockies. So how did that part of the country treat you? You know, I was a big fan of the West Coast, actually. You know, the, the only downside is the states are just huge. <laughs> so, you know, you may be going to play a game a state over and you still got a two-and-a-half-hour, three-hour flight, which is just crazy. But, I mean, it, it was a blast. You know, college basketball in itself is very fun. You know, I was able to make the tournament with my San Francisco Dons team my junior year and um, got to play for Coach Steve Alford at Nevada. That was awesome. And then, obviously, Bobby Hurley and all his, you know, awards and accolades while I was at ASU. What uh, I know you have something going on with the NIL stuff. Why don't you explain that to us and our listeners? Well, you know, I mean, the, the NIL space is just a groundbreaking space in today's day and age, and, 
you know, I'm just trying to do my best to help some of my fellow athletes kind of understand what's all going on as we transition into what will be a fully on new era of college sports as revenue share kind of takes hold here in the next 18 to 24 months. Yeah, uh, Zane Meeks, our guest, uh, Wichita State basketball commit. Jason was talking about uh, you as the founder of uh, the Division I Collective, which you started a, a couple years ago with some other folks. So uh, just tell us exactly what that is, uh, how much traction it's got, and, uh, and what your goals are for that, uh, for that collective. Well, you know, our goal is to just get our student athletes the highest dollar amount possible. Once again, as we step into this new era, you know, it's quite complicated. It's not really a one sentence kind of end all be all. You know, we're just, as I said, we're trying to get athletes the most amount of money as possible. This is the defining period for college athletes and their rights when it comes to television and whatever is set forth here in the next couple years will more than likely be the standard, you know, for quite, quite some time. When, when you were in the portal this year and talking to different schools, is that something that, that has come up? The, uh, the Obviously, NIL and its presence in college sports now, but is that something that's important to you personally? Yeah, you know, I, I just believe I, I've seen with my own eyes the dollar amount that us student-athletes create, you know, especially my fellow, you know, football players and basketball players. We, we create large amounts of, you know, noticeability for the university and just, you know, filling seats every day. And so, you know, I just, I believe that we are entitled to our, our fair share of that and I'm doing everything possible to, you know, get there. Do you want to get into uh, being a sports agent? Is that something that you have your eye on? I know uh, your dad is in law. I think he's an attorney. So is that something that interests you also? Yeah. You know, I, I'm more interested probably in the overarching side of things than rather individual agents, but you know, I mean, we got a lot of time here now between when I have to choose a job after I get done with the Shockers. Zane, with the NIL, how do you, as a player, and I'm all for you guys getting getting paid, 100. percent But don't has it got a little out of hand? Wouldn't you say right now, or where are you at with that? What are your personal thoughts? I mean, I, first of firstly, I think it's long overdue, but. You know, we're kind of sitting in a free market here where there's absolutely no restrictions, and it's it's an, it's an arms race. And, and to some extent, to level the playing field, you're going to need wide-ranging rules that, you know, add some semblance of equality across the country. At, you know, American schools just aren't going to be able to compete with SEC schools. You know, we know that. So there needs to be some sort of just structure to the whole thing. Yeah, you know, that, I think that's all coaches, administrators, and players really want is just some sort of structure that shows us how we're going to operate moving forward. Talking with Zane Meeks, uh, who's committed to play Wichita State uh, basketball next year. So uh, tell us your early impressions of the coaching staff, particularly the head coach, Paul Mills, and, and Quincy Acey, uh, who, who's a guy who works with uh, the big men a lot. Yeah, you know, Coach Mills and I speak the same language. Both of us very, you know, analytical and like to look at basketball through, you know, a little bit of a math lens, not totally, but, you know, we understand percentages and points per possession and, you know, what, you know, there's some spots on the court that are, you know, very much more efficient than others. And we see this through the same eyes. Then, you know, QA, I mean, he's a stud, man. You know, you get on Twitter and you'll probably scroll through a video of him dunking on 15 different NBA <laughs> players. So, you know, I, I'm excited to hopefully, uh, grab some athleticism off of him if he'll trade me some. But, uh, you know, I'm just really excited to get on Wichita and get to work. Yeah, where, we, go ahead. Where are you at right now? Are you in Wichita or are you back in in uh, the Kansas City area? Where are you at right now and when do you plan on getting here if you're not here yet? I'm not here yet. Yeah, I'm back in the, I'm back in the Kansas City area right now. I'm actually planning on heading down this weekend, and I should be ready to go Monday for workouts, you know, pending all the fun medical stuff that schools require. Well, good stuff, man. Congratulations on uh, your commitment to Wichita State basketball. Uh, we all look forward to seeing you on the floor next year, and I'm sure we'll catch up again fairly soon. Sounds good, guys. I appreciate it. Excited to get to Wichita. Save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile and get fiber-powered Internet at home and unbeatable 5G reliability on the go. So whether you're playing a game at home yes, cool. or attending one live, no! 
You can do more without spending more. Learn how to save at cox.com slash internet. Cox Internet is connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Cox Mobile runs on the network with unbeatable 5G reliability as measured by Ookla LLC in the U.S. to H 2023. Results may vary, not an endorsement. Other restrictions apply. Tune in is the audio platform with something for everyone. News. In order to secure convictions in a court of law, it is essential that we conclusively sports. The clock at four. Donchich. The step back three. You bet. Music. You set my world on fire. Yes, and even podcasts. Whatever you love, hear it right here on TuneIn. Go to TuneIn.com or download the TuneIn app to start listening. Start your summer road trip at Midas and get up to $30 off your next repair service. Plus, get a free closer look vehicle check to make sure your road trip ready. So if you need a brake service, an alignment check, or tune-up, hit up Midas for up to $30 off. For more details, request your appointment at Midas.com.